friends. Today we're going to be looking at addition of positive and negative numbers. So you should have cut out your cards where we've got our cash cards. So you should have colored in a light shade of gray with your pencil. And then we have our deck cards, which you should have colored in a light shade of red with your colored pencil right there. So for this lesson today, I'm going to have you pretend to be an accountant keeping track a Jane Doe's account balance right there. So an account balance is simply the current total value that's in the account. So we're going to be looking for the account balance. Okay? Or the money in an account. Okay? So we have debts that are negative numbers things that we're going to take out of the account, and then we have cash here, which are positive numbers. So an account balance is said to be in the black. When there are more cash, when there's more cash in the account than debt. Okay, so we've got an account that's in the red. There's more, we got it, debts than cash. Okay, so go ahead and pause the video right here if you need a little bit more time jotting down those different vocabulary terms that we're going to be using throughout this lesson. I'm going to erase, and I hope that you have paused and got those things down in your notebook. Okay, so we're going to run through a couple of different situations, and you need to be using your cards along with me. Okay, so I want you to go ahead and take five black. Let's go ahead and do three red. So right off the bat here, we can tell that we're going to have a positive amount of money. Our account's going to be in the black right there because we've got more black than we do red. So if I wanted to write this as a number sentence, I'd find positive plus Three, and these were negative numbers, so I'm going to put that in parentheses, negative three. Okay? And so in order to do that, we can say plus a negative is the same thing as subtracting. And you can think about it this way. How many more positives should we have than negatives? Well, as we take a look here, we've got two more than over here. So we have five plus a negative three is equal to Okay, so I want you to make sure to pause right here and jot down that number sentence. We're going to go through a couple more. Okay, so this time we're going to take red counters, eight red counters. And remember, eight red counters, that's going to be negative right there. One, two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, and this time we're only going to add a total of three black counters or positive numbers. Okay, so for this one, the first thing we did was we had a negative eight. And then we added a positive 3, right? So we can tell that our account's going to be in the red. We've got more red counters than we do have black counters. So we're going to have a negative number for our answer there. Well, I've got 2, 4, 6, 8. There's 5 more than 3, right? So negative 8 
plus a positive 3 is equal to negative 5. Or Jane Doe owes $5 still in her account right there. Okay, so make sure to pause right here if you haven't jotted down that number sentence down along with us. We're going to do one more. Go ahead and do seven positive counters. And five debts. And I want you to go ahead and pause right here and write that number sentence down. And when you're done with that, then you can unpause and check for understanding see if you got that number sentence correct. Okay, I hope you've paused and written your number sentence down. Now you're checking. So as we take a look here, we had positive to start with. We had two, four, six, seven. Then we added a negative one, two, three, four, five. Okay. When I add a negative, it's the same thing as subtracting. Where I know I've got two more positives than I have negatives right here. So I've got my account in the black, so I know it's going to be a positive, and I've got eight. Okay, so um, we will go ahead and do your math boxes if you've got a little bit more time, and um, we will see you for your next lesson here shortly. Thanks for watching, friends.